Hey everybody, it is Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I had a couple of orders for the fabric, the scraps or the snippets in the creams and the whites. And I had somebody asking about, you know, what that would look like. So I thought I would just sit here for a little bit with the camera on and go through my fabrics for that and kind of decide even, you know, what I think it should be. I mean, based on what's in the box. So I have my scale with me and I'm not sure I want that really. Let's see how much this weighs by itself. So that's about an ounce. That little bag is cute. And that doesn't add much of anything. That's part of a wall hanging. So I would probably, and remember this is for the pack that has things that would be good for pockets and tabs. That's interesting. That would be a fun tie or you could stamp that. And this pack may not stay what's on the scale. I might come back. So that's kind of a pink color. I have some shabby things in this box as well. So let me see how much this whole thing adds. That's still only 2.5. And then let's see about this. Oh, that's so adorable. Look at that. I hate to cut that. Um, oh, it's so cute. Look at that. I might hang on to that for a little bit before I cut it. Any thoughts about this, people? Should I cut it and use put these in there? Or do you think somebody would want the whole thing? It's got the little, little dolls that have been stitched around with the bonnets. The little girls, I should say. And then it's got this pretty trim. It's, it's got some wear on it and a couple of age spots. And then what is this? Some lace. I don't want to cut into anything else. So if I put that on there, and then this is interesting. Why does it look like this here? It's where two pieces were added together, I guess. Uh, I know that I... Hmm. And again, this pack might not be exactly that because I'm going through quite a lot of fabric. Look at that silky pink with some stitching around the edge. I think that's old. So I had fun out today uh, shopping for the shop. And I, like I said, I'm not listing anything else until every package has gone out. And the reason I'm doing this is because this is part of an order. And I thought I would go ahead and just, I hate to say kill two birds with one stone again, but yeah, that's pretty. I would put that, I guess, with yellows, but then I could cut part of that trim. So if I did that, is anybody saying, no, don't do that? Let's just see what that makes that. That is pretty, though. And then we have, this is cute. This was a like a dish towel, I think. It's got some dirty spots on it. So I probably wouldn't put that in a pack. It's just too worn, but I do want to do something with that. And then, of course, this is not white, but it's kind of shabby. And then this, I love this, the Chanel with the silver, silver thread in it. If anybody is interested in some of this, just let me know. Oh, strings. Strings everywhere. Okay, let's get an 
other stuff. Pretty. So if I put that, and then maybe that let's hmm. get that for right now Was the piece that has that stitching on it. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. This is just some white, feels like cotton or linen. It's it's had some wear for sure, so I'm not going to put that in just yet. I mean, if nothing else, I use fabrics like this to stamp on. It is pretty though. Let's see how much a piece of this. Oh, what is that? That's a neat shape. How much would that add? Let's just see. If you're seeing anything that you want to, oh, that's got paint on it. If you see anything that you want to say like, oh, don't, don't, I wouldn't want that in there, or I would want more of this or that like a little piece of ticking like this, would you want a piece of this in your uh, creams and whites or just stay completely with the color like that? So there is a collar that's been washed. That's really cool. So if I put that there, now let's see what else we have. That's pretty. And then it's a pretty cool piece of fabric. We still have a ways to go. Oh, I love that. And then that. So this pillowcase has been washed. It looks very old. It has definitely got some staining, but look at this needlework. That is really old. So how would I want to do that? That lace would just come right off. Look how delicate that is attached. How delicate the stitching is. So I am thinking that what I would do is probably Let's just, I know, don't, don't freak out. I should have started a little bit higher above the flowers, but it's okay. What? Not necessarily, though, because it's not like we're doing some great big project. I'm still going to save this because I love that color, and it has been washed, like I said, so I know it's clean. Oh, but look at that staining. Oh my goodness. Hello. That's beautiful. So I would probably cut right down here on the end. That is just beautiful. And then if I cut right here. And that gives me more lace over here that has some glorious staining on it. Let's see how much this adds. That scale turned off. So that's only 6.4 ounces. And I think this is just white fabric. Which it, it is nice to have that. It's very nice to have that. Whoa. And then, ooh, I have a lot 
lot of this. So I might just cut a little piece of this. And then I would probably, this is, what is that? Yeah, this is, this has had enough. It almost looks like it was burned. So this has had enough wear that I don't feel bad about cutting this down. Um, like maybe... How do I want to do this? Let's go right around here. that there. And then what is this? A little, like a hanky or a napkin. That would be pretty pressed out. Look at that. It does have some staining. So let's, let's keep moving on for just a second. Which the staining is fine with me. That's part of the, part of the old linen stuff. That's pretty. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty. There's a little tassel. I need to see if I can brush this out, though. It's kind of tangled. And look at this old blue lace. That's pretty. This feels pretty old. Look at that. Let's put that on there. And then maybe... Maybe some of this. Ooh, that's pretty. So how would you feel, what if that was in your pack? That's beautiful. That's old. I can just tell that's old. And then, this should be pretty lightweight. Oh my gosh, I love this. That's so beautiful. Not sure yet what to do with that. Hundred percent cotton bark cloth. And then of course that's not whites and creams, but that was it's kinda in the theme of what ends up in that box. Okay. Ooh. This is, that looks so old. And this has been washed, just so you know, when I come in with this old stuff, it goes straight to the washing machine. And let's see about, let's see how it tears. You can see little fibers going everywhere. I do think stuff like this is so fun to work with. And I love just sitting here cutting this stuff. That looks pretty old. Okay, so if we add that. That's a big piece. Let me fold that back up. What is this? Ooh, I love this satiny stuff. Not, not a ton of it, not too much, but just enough. You know, to add a little something to your page. I wonder though, if I should. Ooh, that, that's, that's just so beautifully crinkled. You could use that to make really pretty page tabs or embellishments. And 
let's see, what is that? And then this. That's pretty. You might want to press this. I don't know, people are different. And then these are those same cotton tassels. They get a little bit tangled up. That's old. Let's see how much that would weigh. So we're still only at 10.8. And then there's another piece. And then... So that, what else is under here? That. So grungy. And then, like, this lace could be sewn onto a page. And it would just be, that would be wonderful. That would be so, oh, that would be a pretty table scarf just like it is, though. I love this old stuff. that and then this if I recall is some nice fabric get some of this lint off of it so I bet a nice piece of this So that's perfect. That's like 12.3 ounces. I'm trying to keep these packs under a pound. And in my, um, so in my Etsy shop, these are $11 because I add a dollar because of the Etsy fees. In my shop, they're 10 because I don't have the same transaction fees. But that is what, that is what one would look like. And you know, once, I'm measuring to get right at 12 ounces. Sorry, I'm reaching back. I would probably, you know, I might go ahead and add one more little thing or two. That's pretty with the blue on the edge. So, you know, if, if you want to leave a comment, how do you feel about things like this? Isn't that amazing? It's got the beads all the way around. Let's see if I can get that string off of there. string tangled up. That's so pretty. And the beads were just, it looks like made right onto it. I'm not sure how old that is, but it looks old. So I would love your feedback if you're inclined to give me feedback and say, you know, watching you go through this stack, I would want more of this. And yes, it would be okay with me. Like if you put something that had a little bit of blue trim. So like if I cut the end of this. And also, how would you feel about a pack of old linens that are not cut? Like this entire table scarf and the other one that had the stains. How would you feel about that? So that puts it, that's still only 12.4 ounces. And let's see, let me show you. Let me just show you more of what's in here. So I have, like this baby doll dress is in the bottom. I was gonna do something with that. And then another doll dress, piece of ribbon. But like this is pretty. I would consider that creams and whites and strings. And then there 
fingers. So if I cut a piece of that, got quite a bit of that lace, and then, ooh, this is so neat. I'm not sure. That looks like it was, what was that? I love the colors of these things. I just love this. And what else do we have? So like this, I would consider that creams and whites. And then this, I love this fabric. I've used this in a lot of projects. So that's 13.6 ounces. I'm going to consider that one done. So let me know what you think about this. There are several of you who asked and ordered. So I would love to get your feedback on what you think about this. Um, even if you've already ordered, let me know if this is what you, what you are thinking or if you want something, you know, say, oh, I want more just plain fabric like if you want more plain stuff to work with that's old or if you're really interested in these the trim edges or the lace or little fun pieces like that and trims like this are you interested in like some of that that's almost a yellow color so just let me know i'm going to continue packaging Thank you for your patience. Honestly, I have been packaging every day and going to the post office with an armful and yeah, everything, I'm not gonna stop until everything goes out. These have been some large orders and I do try to package everything carefully um, and I had to make a trip to get more tape. So anyway, thank you so much for bearing with me while I listed all of this and while I'm getting it all out of the, out of the house and to the post office. So anyway, I'll see you soon. Bye for now.